Hello everybody, my name is Phoenix Fire and welcome to Pokemon Arcane, a brand new fan game brought to you by Scorbunny Channel again. So uh, yeah, let's get into it, shall we? Hello, sorry to keep you waiting. Welcome to the world of Pokemon. My name is Mugo. People call me the Pokemon Professor. If you need help, I'm certainly capable of giving it. No, thank you. Oh, hello. There's sprites now. Ah, oh, that's really cool. This world is inhabited by creatures we call Pokemon. People of Pokemon live together by supporting each other. Some people play with Pokemon, some battle with them. But we don't know everything about Pokemon yet. There are still many mysteries to solve. That's why I study Pokemon every day. Now then, are you a boy or a girl? Well, yeah, a <laughs> girl. And yep, I'm going to go with the usual name, so just give me a second. And yep, it's going to be Quilotus. So you're Quilotus. Quilotus, are you ready? Your very own Pokemon journey is about to unfold. You'll face fun challenges. A world of dreams and adventures await you. Also, yeah, I am kind of recording this um, while I'm still a bit sick, so that's why I'm a bit... <sighs> all over the place and why I sound very full of cold at the minute. You know, I'll be okay, I'll be alright. <coughs> hey mum. Are you awake? I'll show you around. Well, if having excuses for entire time, here you go. Here's your running excuse and poker gear. Okay, thank you mum. Thank you. You're all set. Have fun on your journey. Awesome, cool. And also, yeah, my hearing's a little bit off as well, but I should be okay. Hello, how are you? Good to see you. I'm going to go to the Pokemon lab. My name's Juniper. Nice to meet you. Oh, your name is Quilotus? That's a nice name. My friend Clyde is waiting at the Pokemon lab. So let's go, shall we? Okay then, Juniper. Cool, I'll be with you in a sec. Um, just going to do a little bit of wandering around and stuff, and then, yeah, I'll be with you in a second. Alright then, I'm guessing this is a gym. I mean, the lab. So yeah, here we go. Oh yeah. You made it in time, Quilotus. Your friends are waiting to choose these with their starters. Here, take one of these Pokemon. You go first, Quilotus. Okay then, so... You want Timberry. Alright then, so we can't see the starters. So what I'm going to do is, I'm going to go through them one by one and then reset and then so you guys could see what the starters look like um so yeah Timberry oh uh, yep yeah, I chose Timberry alright Clyde your turn I'll choose Bumper okay Juniper um I'm gonna go with Damper you guys have your own Pokemon I'll give you some three Pokedexes Okay, cool. So he's going to give us a Pokedex each. Thank you. Cool. This Pokemon. Always keep doing battles. You must collect eight gym badges to go to the Pokemon League. I have to go now. See ya. Will he always be leaving in such a hurry? That was interesting for your friends, of course. Well, have a nice day. Okay, yeah, um, what I'm going to do now is I'm just going to show you guys Timberry real quick. Oh, hi! Hello, you're a little grass wolf fox dog. Oh, that's adorable. Okay, cool. Um, so yeah. Uh, you are a physical attacker. Okay. And your moves are attack and growl. Okay, cool. So yeah, now I'm going to go through the thing and show you guys uh, the other starters. And yep, yeah, this is Bonfur. The, oh hi, the fire type bear, question mark. And yeah, you're a uh, physical attacker as well. And you have Pound and Leah. Alright then, awesome. You look really, really cool. Despite being a fire type. And then we have Damper. The, oh, water cat, I'm going to say. So yeah, okay. And you are a... 
very much a special attacker. Okay, and you have Scratch and Tail with. Okay then, cool. That's the other I'm actually choosing now, and I've gone for Bonfur, the Fire Bear, which looks really cute. Um, and yep, Bonfur's a male one. So yeah, I'm just gonna call you. Um, I'm gonna go with Pyro. I know it's not very imaginative or whatever, but hey ho, there we go. Ah, uh, yep, 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 yep. Now I'm just gonna uh, go through all the dialogue really, really quickly. Uh, because we've already heard all of this and stuff. Uh, so yeah, let's go, shall we? Oh, hello. You almost forgot to give you some Pokeballs before you leave. Oh yeah, cool, five Pokeballs. Thank you, thank you. There you go. Have fun on your adventure. Alright then, so now let's get this show on the road, shall we? So yeah, we're going to leave Dannyville Town now. Um, and go off on our adventure, so... Oh. Hey, wait for me! You're heading to Route 1 when you got a Pokemon? But let me tell you secrets and stuff. Because it would be awesome. So, are you ready for the Pokemon Showdown? Let's do it! Oh, okay then, yeah, yeah, yeah. So we're having our first Pokemon battle against Juniper. Okay. <coughs> okay, you're fair dues. Uh, so yeah, she has the the one that's weak to us. Okay, cool. At least for now, because I don't know what the secondary types are, because there is no Pokedex to look into or anything. So I'm going in this completely blind. I don't know what the new Pokemon are or anything. So yeah, okay, let's use Pound on you. Okay then. Growl to lower my attack. Yeah, lowering attack. Well, that's kind of a pain, but... um. Yeah, just gonna keep on using pound. Didn't use tackle. Luckily, you didn't lower my defense. Let's see it. Now all I could do is pound on you at the minute. Of course, I could lear you to lower your. I think that lowers defense, but no. Just gonna keep on pounding you. Uh, yep, Tim very fainted. The pirate gained 94 points and of course leveled up, as is customary. Oh, and you learn Ember as well. Okay. <laughs> Although I can see why now, um, when you level up once you get your elemental attack and not straight away, otherwise you could freeze through them easily. But first, let me hear your Pokemon. There you go, your Pokemon are nice and healthy. Also, I have a gift for you. Oh, the XP share. Oh, uh, thank you, Jesus. Enjoy your adventure. I'll be on Route 1. See you around. Bye bye. Okay, cool. Thank you, Juniper. That was awesome. The XP share straight away. Cool. So, yeah, just gonna have a wander around here. And what is on Route 1? We have a. Oh, it's a Hoot Hoot. Hello. Cool. Um, no surprise in there. Uh, one of my favourite flying. normal flying Pokemon. Oh, no, not just because it's an owl. <laughs> yeah, okay. Yeah, go try out Ember on you. Okay, that's a bit slow, but I can work with it. <coughs> yep, who to use Growl to lower my attack. But. Oh, uh, yeah, that's kind of slow. Yeah, lowering Pyro's attack. But luckily for you, Pyro has Ember, which is special attack. So, yeah, there we go. Uh, yep, who to use Growl again, lowering attack some more. But even if we did use Pound, um, it would still knock out the Hoot Hoot. And yeah, I don't think I'm going to catch um, Pokemon that I know. I think I'm going to catch only new Pokemon to this game. Um, so yeah, it's going to be super, super interesting and stuff. But yeah, now Pyro's level 7. Cool. Yeah, right then. Uh, is there anything new here? in this bit of grass. Good yeah, come on, give me a new peep. Hello. Yes, yes we do, we have a seed ant. Hello. Hey fella. Um we all like brownie colour, so by that logic I'm gonna guess you're the common normal type. You know, common early normal type. 
So, I'm going to use Pound on you. Alright, you're using Tail Whip's lower, lower defense here. See, I keep forgetting what lowers what, <laughs> what early things lower what. Let's see, yep, I'm going to use a Pokeball on you. Um, no, she didn't want to be caught that time. Okay, fair dues. Oh uh, yeah, another Tail Whip's lower defense. And of course, going to use another Pokeball. So yeah. And... What? Nope. Didn't even shake once. Blimey. Yeah, this, uh... She really doesn't want to get in the ball, do you, buddy? And I have a great name for you, too. One, two, three. There we go. Awesome. The seed end was caught. Cool. Yeah, I'm glad that she managed to get in the ball, okay. <coughs> and yes, seed end was added to the Pokedex. They even tried eating themselves at one point. Uh, their seed disguises are so good that they actually trick themselves into thinking their own species are nuts. Oh my god! <laughs> okay. <coughs> but yeah, I know exactly what I'm going to name you, buddy. And yeah, I'm going to name you Hazel. Uh, because, you know, Hazelnut and because it's a female name. So yeah. <coughs> so yeah, we go to the team, Hazel. Awesome. So yeah, now you'll start to get some passive XP from me battling with Pyro. Hello, I'm searching for Power Call. Okay. Is that another peep in this area? <coughs> Maybe? No? Okay, then we got ourselves another Hootoot. Okay, that's fair. That is fair, dude. I see if Pyro's gonna get thrown out again. <coughs> <coughs> Uh, you're gonna go in for another a pound of me things. Ooh, that did quite a bit. Okay then. Oh uh, yeah, another pound, cool you. Yeah. Um so yeah, I think I'm gonna just have a wander around this area and stuff and uh and yeah, see what I can find and if there's anything new I will uh of course update you lovely people on it, so so yeah, let's just see what this is. Okay, Hootoot. See ya, I'll be right back. Alright then, um, now yeah, we didn't manage to catch any new peeps, but we're on the solar fort town, I think that said. Um, and yeah, just gonna heal up real quick, so. Uh, yep. Would you like to rest your Pokemon? Yes, please. Uh, yep, thank you for healing up Pyro and Hazel. Okay, yeah, cool. What, what do you have to say? Oh, okay, yeah, nothing, nothing much. <laughs> Alright then, uh, see so ya. Yeah. Uh, let's just have a bit of a wander here. Okay, you're on the back power core as well. Okay then. Okay, yeah, uh, you haven't really got that much to say either. You're just sitting around in the house. Okay. Alright, that's a Fletchling, okay. I didn't really get that from the little front sprite, but okay then, yeah. Right. Okay, yep, yeah, we were just wondering about TV commercials. Okay then, so yeah, there wasn't really much in this town, really. Um, oh, apart from my shop, okay. And of course, a, uh, a Pokemon Center. Oh, hello. Okay, you're a school? Right. My students teach you how to do arts and crafts. Okay, fair dues. <laughs> See, so, yeah, not really anything too useful in this um, in this town. There is the Pokemon Center and the uh, shop, of course. But yeah, uh, now I'm on Route Two, so oh yeah. Okay, cool. I'm here a cherry berry here. Okay, let's see. Yeah, um, I think they're for paralysis. I'm not sure. But oh, we have our first trader as well. Saying he'll battle us with his sedent. Okay. And yep, sedent. Cool. And the youngster Rick. Just me. And yeah, this was a bail, okay. Yeah, can't really see the difference, but yeah. And yep, Pyro there. Nearly level 8. As well, although Route 1 wasn't really that big, so yeah. Um, okay, a bite. Yeah, doesn't really do that much. I'm gonna use another ember on the sedent. Um, although yeah, I should really remember that uh, Pyro is a physical attacker, 
not a special attacker at the minute. But yeah, we have it, and it's a stab move, so that kind of makes up for it as well. Uh, but yeah, awesome, now our pirate's level 8. And uh, Haze is level 4. Yeah, doesn't really learn anything, okay. Fair dues, and yeah, our first ever trainer fight went well. Well, part of Juniper, of course. But yeah, what do we have here then? And the winner is a Patrat. Okay then. And yes, Patrat, the um, the common early mammal introduced in Generation Five of Pokémon. Uh, so Pokémon Black and White. Um, and yeah, Patrat is an alright Pokémon. Uh, but yeah. Uh, Leah, okay then, lowering my attack again. Who was the attack or was it defense? Yeah, defense, okay, yeah. <laughs> Just in case you could get another hit off Pyro, but uh, that'll be a no. Oh, uh, yep, yeah. Patra fainted. Okay. Yeah, Pyro gave 16 points, and Hazel gave a few more too. Alright then, oh blimey. <laughs> Uh, what do we run into this time? Okay, then it's another Hootoot. Alright. Fair dues. Uh, yeah, let's just take care of this Hootoot quickly. Or we'll just... Yeah, we'll just go, actually. Fair dues, just to see what that item is. See, so, yeah, and we have a... Oh, another Pokeball! Well, that's handy. Cool. Oh blimey, another encounter. Okay, then what's it going to be this time? <coughs> yeah, it's another seed end going. <laughs> Hello there, buddy. Uh, so yeah, I'm going to take care of you with a... Uh, Ember. Yeah, Ember. I wonder if it's Pyro that learns smoke screen. Okay, then I thought that was Hazel. Oh, fair dues. Take a hit back. Okay, then. I'm going to go with another ember, I think. Oh, yep, see them fainted. Okay, yeah, another few points, so... And now Hazel's level 5, cool. And Hazel has bite now, alright then. Oh, uh, yep. Huh. Get ready for your combat skills. Okay, then, what do you got? Uh, last Annie. Oh, another Patrat, okay. Okay, fair enough. Also, I think Patrat's meant to be a meerkat, I think. I'm guessing so anyway, I don't know. Or maybe a gopher, I don't know. Maybe a oh, that was a crit, okay, cool. I see, I'm gonna go Pyro, another Ember. And yep, that's the Patrat down, awesome. The power gave 37 points and it's now level 9. Good boy. Good job. Alright, power core. There we go. Now we get C1. Oh, hello, power core. Your name reminds me of that I've heard it somewhere else. And your design actually reminds me that I've seen it somewhere else too. Oh. But yeah, anyway. Uh, Ember. Okay, yep, yeah, uh, power core use tackle. <coughs> I'm gonna use another pound for pyro. Okay, yep, yeah, 73 points, awesome. And yep, yeah, last, last Annie down. Cool, Leo. Uh, so, yep, yeah, let's uh, pick up this new. Alright, then, yeah, new antidote, okay, cool. Alright, what's in this bit of grass here then? What's in here? Oh yeah, another Hootoot. <laughs> well, we can definitely say for sure that Hootoot is common <laughs> in this game. But yeah, never mind. Um, yeah, just gonna carry on. And yes, I know it's XP, but... Oh, there you are. I was just looking for you. Okay, hi. I was catching up in here. This would be happening right now. They'll have a few more questions. Uh, okay. Oh, this time I'm about to gain a massive what? 
you can't run until you get ready to rumble. Now let's show you how, Quilotus. Okay, fair dudes. Oh, hi Clyde. Alright, so that's what you actually look like. Okay then. Let's get Pokemon Trainer Clyde with his starter. We dump her. Now unfortunately Pyro might go down because Damper is strong against Pyro and Damper is level 9 as well, Jesus. Um, but yeah, let's just try our best here, shall we? So yeah, gonna go for a pound. Oof, that does kind of a bit. But yeah, because it's level 9, Damper has water gun, so... Yep, Pyro faints. So now we just have uh, Hazel. Who is level 5? So yeah, we might lose this one, unfortunately. Yeah, just gonna try it for a bite. Yeah, Hazel uses Damper uses bite. Uh, scratch rather. Yeah, water gun, how much does that do? Oh, that does quite a bit. Okay. Yeah, yeah, we're definitely gonna lose this one. But that's fair enough. Yes, I win against you. My starter Pokemon is even stronger. And yep, thank you for healing us again. <laughs> Have fun, pal. Okay, cool. Uh, thank you. Have you healed your Pokemon as well? I don't know. You know, in Dulfer Forest. Alright then. And yeah, let's check out what's in here, shall we? And our encounter is a... Oh, hi! Larfe. Okay. I'm going to go out on a wild limb here and say that Larfe is Bug Fairy. Or at least Bug for now, that could turn Fairy? I don't know. Yeah, okay, struggle Bug. Alright then, that did not do anything. But yeah, I'm, uh, I'm definitely going to catch him, so... So, yep. And thanks to earlier, we have a spare Pokeball free just in case. So yeah, one, two... And yeah, there we go. Awesome. Yep, Lafe was caught. Yeah, cool. We got a new Pokemon to the team. Awesome. You get 16 XP, and now Haze is level six. Yep, Bug type. Born in the humus of lush forests, the Lafe's protect themselves by camouflaging in a cocoon of leaves. Oh, that's really, really cute. Yeah, all right then. Uh, what am I going to call you? No, I didn't mean to do that. But yeah, just because I want to, um, and it's after a flower, I'm going to call you Subaki. <clears throat> no way, sorry, I'm thinking of something else. But yeah, I'm going to name you Subaki. And yep, Subaki has been added to the team. Cool. <coughs> oh, here's another trainer in a sec. I don't know why I just ran up and down like that. <laughs> but yeah. Ooh, hello Spinarak. Awesome. I would definitely add you to the team if I wasn't just using new peeps. But unfortunately for you, uh, Pyro has Ember, so uh, yep, but sorry. Ooh, the Spinarak didn't faint. Oh, okay then, damn, I would definitely add you to the team. And no surprising what I would name you as well, because you're a female spider. Kind of spider, you don't have eight legs, you have six. Yep, Spinarak fainted, and Pyro gained 32 points. Ooh, nearly enough for level 10. Oof, very much nearly. Yep, hello. Buggers are attacking me for good, are they? Okay, fair enough, thanks for the warning. Yeah, a book at your Tomo. I've seen that laugh, eh? Okay. Very. Also, yeah, laugh, eh? It does look really, really comfy. And there's piles of leaves that uh, he's got himself wrapped up in. Yeah, Pyro used Ember. That's a lot of damage. Ah, but yeah. Right, well, struggle bug. Okay, that doesn't do anything, so. Oh, yeah, special attack fell. But luckily, 
pyro is a physical attacker at the minute, so yep, pound and go to level 10. Awesome. We had a Subaki, yep, Subaki grows to level 5. Okay, cool. I was kind of expecting Hazel to level up as well, but fair dues. Yeah, awesomeness. Okay then. So I do like the music in this game so far. It's really, really cool. Alright, what do we want into now? Oh, Grubbin! Okay then, cool. Now Grubbin is a bug type Pokemon, in case you couldn't tell. Um, mono bug that was introduced in uh, Pokemon Sun and Moon. Um, and its final evolution is awesome. <laughs> I'm not going to spoil it for later. Uh, yeah, it's really, really cool. And I do like it. But yeah. Ooh, space attack fell again. Oh no, accuracy fell, okay. Yeah, use pound one more time. And yep, that's the Grumman down. Sorry, buddy. Oof. Yeah, who else uh, gets the thing? Oh no, nobody. Okay, cool. It just uh, hung on there for a real second. Yeah, alright then, cool. But yeah, I'm just going to uh, battle these trainers, go around the woods, and then yeah, I'll uh, see you in a sec again. And yep, <laughs> um, on the way through just inside the forest, we ran into a, a new peep, um, which is called Drew Pig. Uh, so yeah, let's, uh, and yeah, Hazel's out of the front for now. And uh, yeah, <laughs> as you can see now, the battle's just been going on for a few seconds, so... Awesome, and Drew Pig is caught. Cool. <laughs> Alright then, <laughs> cool. So yeah, um, that was short and sweet, but yeah. Yeah, let's just see what typing Drew Pig is. Because, yeah, I have no idea. Oh, Drew Pig is a dark one, okay. Huh. Drew Pig is an annoying pig on the farm. Its species feed on yucky berries to fill their belly. Oh, okay then. Fair dues. Huh. You're an interesting one. See ya. I am going to call you. Shadow. Yeah, yep, Shadow is added to your party. Okay then, cool. And yep, now I went uh, back in Dulfer Forest because I was catching Drew Pig on the way to go back to heal everyone. But now we are on Route 4. Because yeah, I had to go all the way back to heal people. And then on the way back, back, yeah, I ran into uh, to this beep here on Route 4. Huh, and she sends out her own Drew Pig, okay. Hey, yep, but now I know what typing you are. Also, um, yeah, Pyro learned a new move. Um, and yeah, he's level 12 now. But yeah, uh, he learned Mag Punch, which I kind of should have used there, to be fair. But yeah, let's just see how much this does. Woo! Okay then, just over half and use the shoot. But yeah, let's see what Mag Punch looks like. Oh, it looks just like the animation of a bullet punch. Okay then. Although I could be getting that confused, I don't know. But yeah, all right then. But yeah, awesome. And yep, Shadow now level six. And oh, Sand True. No, no, I'm not going to. And yep, Sand True, the ground type, introduced in Generation One. <laughs> See, so yeah, I'm just gonna go for good on Mac Punch there. Okay, the Defense Girl, upping your physical defense. That's fair. That's uh, that's exactly what I would expect you to do because Sancho's thing is to uh, curl up into a ball. Uh, but yeah, another defense girl. Okay, then so now you have plus two in your defenses, but unfortunately you haven't done anything about your special defense. So yeah, gonna use Ember. And yep, Sancho is down. Also, I do like the lovely sunset in the background. That's really really cool. Well, what happened? I beat you. Huh. Yeah, alright then. Oh, what else do we run into now? Here, <laughs> It's a greed. It's a seedent. Sorry, I only say greedent then. But yeah, alright then. Yeah, hey there, buddy. Yep, yeah, I'm gonna go for a mag punch now because we know you're normal type. And yep. Yeah, 
<laughs> Just, uh oh. <clears throat> and yep, Shadow grew to level 7. Okay then, cool. I do apologise for that. I don't know why that's so, so slow. But yeah, oh, blimey, another encounter. Okay then. And what does it be this time? Oh, fledgling. Hey there, buddy. Yep, go, Pyro. Right then, will we reach level 13 by the end of this episode? Maybe? I don't know. But yeah, Mag Punch. Because you are part normal type. Yep, Fletchling is normal and flying type. That, evolved, that fully evolves into norm, uh, flying and fire type. So it's a very useful Pokemon to have um, if your one has uh, a flame body. Because it's handy for eggs. But yeah, 27 points. And yep, there we go. And I'm going to just pick these two berries here. Okay, then we've got a Petcha Berry. Alright, then I think that one's for Paralysis. I'm sure of it. And an uh, Aspear Berry. I can't remember what Aspear Berries are useful for. But yeah, alright then. Move down a bit. Alright, then what's on this little bit of grass here? What is among here? <laughs> Just hello. Yeah, it's a seed end again, okay. There yep, go Pyro. And yep, gonna use Mac Punch on you because yet again normal type. And level difference, so yeah, that should one hit you now. Yeah. Yeah, sorry seed end. Yep, got all the XP. Alright then, so now we're challenged by Hiker Bold, and he says that is Rock and Roller. Okay then, yes, yeah, so now we're running into some rock type Pokemon here in this um, this very rocky area. So yeah, go Pyro. Um, and yeah, Pyro is now level 13. Um, so yeah, luckily for Pyro, he does our Mac Punch, but uh, if we chose in the Grass or Water starter, then, well, yeah. <laughs> Rock and Roller will be slightly easy to deal with, but... Uh, as I say, thanks to us learning Mac Punch. Yeah, there we go. That happened. Let's uh, see so yeah. The Hike Bold one to send out is Kankwart. Ooh, another new peep. Awesome. Um, now, I have no idea what typing you're going to be, so I'm going to leave it to uh, Shadow. Yeah, yeah, I'm going to send in Shadow this time. Because, you know, I don't want Pyro to get all the limelight and stuff, and I'm really, really intrigued what Shadow evolves into because I'm guessing Shadow can evolve. So yeah, let's go! Look at that little pig butt. So yeah, Kankwart! Oh! Hi! Hey there, little buddy! Oh, you've got two different colour eyes as well, that's really cool. But yeah, gonna try Pursuit on you. Okay. Okay, that was a neutral hit. So... Are you Rock-type then? Because you seem to have like gems on you and stuff, so. so yeah, you might do, but. <laughs> yep, didn't really get a hit on. get a hit in on Shadow. My rock broken! Um, and yeah, we uh, we really didn't do that much left to him. Uh, but yeah, now I'm uh, just gonna uh, just hop off for a sec. And here we are again. In. Cuddletick City? Oh, that sounds adorable. But yeah, okay then. Um, now yeah, just gonna have a... Oh, hi. Yeah, it does have a gym. Okay then. The Cuddletick Gym Nitty is in here. He's in the park nearby. Please come back later. Okay then, cool. So yeah, I'm gonna leave this episode here, guys and girls. If you enjoyed it, please be sure to leave a like, comment on what names you want me to give. And if you're new here to subscribe, that would be amazing. And if you want to, uh, please, please help me out to Patreon. It would be awesome. But yeah, until next time, have a good one. Bye-bye.